Welcome back, guys. You could probably tell in my voice, right, that I'm like in a good mood. <laughs> Things are starting to get back to normal. It's good news. Uh, and I'm not going to be talking about vaping in this episode. I'm going to give you a vape-free episode. How about that? Because I'm sure for some of you, it's like, oh, my God, stop talking about it. Right, so um, I've got all the icons turned on. Why have I got all the icons turned on? Because um, after the last episode, you know, I was talking about, like, maybe adding a new industry or whatever. But there was, like, one or two things that I need to have a look at. When I started actually looking around, like, with all the icons on, I suddenly started to realize that, actually, there's loads of stuff that needs to get sorted out. Like, like really, loads of stuff. So um, I'm going to turn some of the stuff. I'm going to turn. I'm going to turn all the vehicle icons off, and I'm going to turn the lines off. Because what we're looking at primarily is uh, where we've got stuff like backing up, and there's actually quite a lot that needs to get done. Where should we start? Where should we get? I tell you what. This farm down here. Now this is not Chris's farm, right? And um, you can tell it's not Chris's farm because it's doing quite well. <laughs> Hi Chris. Hi Oz. How you doing, guys? Right, so we've got like a fair old amount of grain backing up here. Look at this, 295 grain. So um, I think we need a few more vehicles on this line, shipping that stuff. Uh, and we're not up to max. I'm, I'm sure that's getting slowed down because we're at 11.22. Well, we want this maxed out. We want this like full on production. So uh, what are we going to do? We're going to add, let's see, how many, how many vehicles have we got on this line? God only knows. It's, it's bound to be like a fair few. Oh, you know, look at that. Not that many, really. What's that? Like, pff, I don't know. What's that? Like 40, 40 vehicles, maybe? Something like that? I don't know. Um, but I'm going to bang another, let's see. Opal Blitz is um, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Ooh, somewhere between 10 and 20, I'm thinking. Um, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Another 18. Let's bang another 18 on there. Set line all and chiddly cow and grain. Boom. Now, uh, am, like, am I, in, I'm going to run this. I'm going to start running this on. Wow, is it just me or does that sound pretty loud? I'm going to have to check this afterwards and see if um, see if that's very loud. Oh, no, it was just because I was close. So, man, that's loud when you get down there with all these blooming trucks. Okay, stay away from that. My God, damn, that was pretty freaking loud. Right, so, uh, first problem, getting addressed. Next. So, if we're, if we're going to be shipping more of the grain and cows over here, uh, then we're probably going to need to ship more food. We've already got like 150 backing up. So, uh, this one over here will do, I guess. So, we want, I don't know, let's bang another... 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15-ish. 15 15-ish. 15 and they're going to go on the Chudley Cow and... Uh, no, on the Aspatria food line. Boom, off you go, boys. God, noisy trucks. Go away, noisy trucks. Okay, so that's going to be shipping more stuff there. Now, um, before the episode started, um, I didn't like... I wasn't doing, like, nothing. Uh, I did go through, like, all the lines and, uh, and take off anywhere that was waiting for full loads. Because we want stuff running smoothly now. We're making tons of cash. We're up to almost two billion. So, yeah. Um, I would like to start running this a lot more on the faster speeds and start to, like, because we're already up to, like, 1952. Um, I think we want to get through to modern times. And then we can stop worrying about upgrading and stuff. And then we can just, like, set everything to, like, its max and focus on our ultimate goal of meeting the UPEC challenge and getting everything shipped to every town. That's where we want to get to. Right, so we've, um, yeah, we've added more vehicles on there, so that's good. Well, we're yeah, still around the 150, 160 mark. So the extra 15 vehicles on there, hopefully should start bringing that down. We'll keep an eye. Uh, we're already starting to eat into this by the look of it. Yeah, that's good. And yeah, production's dropped off a little bit, but hopefully now that we're moving stuff, look at all these trucks queued up to pick all that stuff up. Now they'll get there. Hopefully. Ah, uh, yeah, it's already on its way back up, I think. Look, yeah, back up 900. Yeah, ticking up nicely. Good. So that's not Chris's farm and um, Ozzy's <laughs> Greg's steak bake factory. <laughs> I love those names. Right. Now, let's have a look down here because I noticed that we've got, uh, we've got a bit of oil down here. 
306. So I'm going to do something that you guys have been, well, like quite a lot of you guys have been nagging me to do for freaking ages. Um, this train here. Now, I could, I could just convert this to, um, to electric. No, I'm not going to. I probably will later on. But for now, I'm going to do, I'm going to, I'm going to double head this train. Because people keep saying, can you do it? And will you do it? And so we're going to do it. So this, uh, what do we want? Replacement vehicles. So we're going to double head this with um, a couple of these A3 slash fires. We're running six. So we'll double head it and we'll run 12 trucks. So uh, you, we want you moved up the track. Come on, come on, move. Oh, God, it's, it's a bit fiddly, this. There we go, and then we want six more. Oh, we've got the new ones. Oh, now let's see. These carry these. Uh, these carry nine. These carry fifteen. So, like, call it double. These weigh ten tons. These only weigh fifteen. So these are definitely better. Um, they're a lot more expensive, though. Is the only thing. So, do we get rid of these? So instead of instead of running. 12 of those, we'd want to run like uh, six, maybe like maybe eight of those. Let's just, let's try it. See, I'm thinking like, because they, they weigh so much less, we could probably run like 10 of these. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10. I'm going to run, I'm going to try it with 10. I'm, we can, let's see, let's see. So I replace now. Uh, 80 million? Really? Okay. Well, yes. Okay. Man, that was more than I was expecting. Right. Let's whiz this along. We've got a lot to get through, so I want to kind of get on with this. Go away, autosave. Thank you. Right. Let's go down here. So, we're going to have our first ever, I think, double-headed train. Now, I could have done a push and pull thing, but I'm just going to double-head it. So, let's see. How does this thing actually get on up this hill? It's going to be interesting to see. Has it got the power? Well, it's... It's keeping up 30 miles an hour. Is it going to start to accelerate as it gets like up here? Is I thought, think where it starts to get a bit flatter, maybe. It is pretty steep all the way up here, though. No, it's steep all the way. Once it gets to the top up here, hopefully we'll see the damn thing like accelerate a bit. What's the power? Oh, it's it. we're starting to starting to accelerate now. What's the power? Well, the power rate is mediocre. Here we go. Now we're moving, and now we've got a capacity of like 150 on these things, which should boost things along pretty nicely. Yeah, 41, 42. What's the max speed on these? What is it? 62. Oh, we're ticking up nicely now. Let's put you up there, out of the way. Let's have a look at this. Double header. Full on. I wanted to see it going through here, because we just, we, we just don't see this bridge enough. Because it's that was a feat of engineering that bridge. All right, crack on. Man, so I got I got so much to do. It's insane. Uh, what speed are we doing? Yeah, we're up to 62. So at least we got to max speed at some point during the journey. And there we go. All right, so so that's gonna work. So that's going to be dumping a lot more fuel up here for distribution. So that's kind of a good thing. Alrighty. Next. Now, um, let's um, let's go back to normal speed. Uh, logs. Yeah. We've got a fair amount of logs building up here. We need to get them shipped. So, pause. Uh, how many... This is bringing back planks. How many trucks are we using on these? Oh, uh, well... Probably easier, bring up the line. The Silver Branch 
And what do I want? I want vehicles. So we're running with 10. Man. Gotta say, I, I'm kind of tempted to electrify that and have some like big trains on there. But um, what do you think? I mean, I could just I could double head it and have like really long trains. Which would be kind of fun, wouldn't it? Should we, go on, should we just do it? Because I know you guys like that kind of stuff. Go on, we'll do it. We'll do it. What the hell? So we want, we're going to have two. Well, mind you, um, as a two and a half, I'm just, I was kind of toying with the idea of using Baden's. But now we'll, we'll use the A3 size fives, I think. I am going to have to start moving towards electrification though. There's no getting away from it at this point. So we're going to have uh, a couple of these puppies. And have we got a new... No, same state car. So what did I say? We were running 10. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Now that is too long. It's like 400 meters. Um, so that kind of doesn't cut it. Hmm. Okay, what about, okay, if we just use a single, right, uh, let's get rid of all of these. I'm going to see, like, how they perform. If we just put on, like, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. I'm going to increase the capacity by 50%. Um, replace now. Yes. Okay, go. So let's see. What kind of speed is this baby going to get up to? That's going to be the big question. This is kind of the ha, the log jam at the moment. Ah, see what I did there? This is kind of the log jam. Um, and if we can shift more logs. See, we're shifting up to 195. The question is... How is this going to handle that many? Uh, the power rating is now poor. And it, it means that it takes a lot longer to like clear the station. Which means these trains are sitting here waiting. Oh man, I don't think I don't think that's necessarily a particularly good solution. I mean, the best thing to do would be to electrify it. Should I should I just freaking electrify it? I gotta say, I'm pretty freaking tempted. I'm te I'm tempted to actually reverse that and send it back in and replace it because I I just don't think that works very well. Come on, right? Let's do it. Let's do it. We're gonna electrify. So, um, boom, 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 boom. what am I gonna do? Upgrade this to uh, let's have high speed anchor tenneries. Like, what the hell? So, uh, yeah, apply that. Now, uh, in the last patch, they um, they did something to improve the upgrading of these tracks. When I read into the patch notes a bit closer, what they did was they uh, they made the colours clearer, which, um, which isn't quite as awesome as I hoped this upgrade was going to be, but... Um, it's still a good thing. So what do I want? I want uh, I want to change this to high speed tracks, I guess. And catenaries, yes. Go to the upgrade tool. And now these colours are much stronger colours. So it's much easier to see what you're doing, which is a very, very good thing. So let's um, do some upgrading. So boom, boom, and the other one, and that bit in there. And boom, and we'll do that bit as well, I suppose. Because otherwise the trains won't be able to get out. Yeah. Oh, we've got a collision there. Okay, fine. Thanks very much. Oh, the other thing is, where you get like tiny little bits of track that need to be upgraded, it actually makes them look bigger in the highlighting so that you can see them easier. So that's another good thing. I love the fact that the guys are still working on this and, in, and improving it. You can do this from further out so you can do bigger sections as well, which is nice. Because it's easier to see. So, boom, boom. Boom, boom. Well, I mean, it does kind of spoil the view a little bit, which is kind of what I was trying to avoid. But uh, at the end of the day, we want to ship stuff, so we have some big-ass trains running around. Alrighty. 
So, I'll go to this station as well, haven't I? Yeah, I have. Right, so we want to upgrade you to high speed containers. Yes, apply. Boom. Right, go back to the other end. I'm going to flip this train around and send it back to the station. So you flip around. Is it going to go back into the station? Yes, very, very slowly. Right, you stop. There we go. Okay, so that's going to go back in there. So what are we going to do to this then? So now that we can have nice, awesome, super duper electric trains, what do we want? Um, replace. We want, let's get rid of all of this. Let's just get rid of all of that. Right, what are we going to put on here? We've got the, um, we've got the 4 slash 7s. Now they're 62 miles an hour, blah, 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 blah. We've also got the, now this was the new one that we got, the RE 4 slash 4. That's a lightweight for passenger trains. Yeah, no. Um... That's 56. I think we want the full size 7s. They've got a good top speed. They're nice and powerful. Yeah, right. So that's what it's going to be. So it's going to be an 80 full size 7 with 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Oh, man. I hate it when you get the blooming auto save when you're trying to do this because you lose count. Let's try that again. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. 15 was what I was going to go for, isn't it? That's an extra 50% capacity. What's this producing at the moment? This is set, this is only producing like 750 at the moment. What is, has it produced? Um, charts. So yeah, we did have a peak up to 1,000. But I'm thinking really this needs to be running like close to 20 trucks to have the capacity that we want. So what do I say? 15, 16, 17. What are they? These are three... 320s or 360s? 320s, aren't they? Yeah. So, yeah, we'll go up to 322 then. Uh, I've no idea how many trucks that was now. <laughs> Let's do that again. <laughs> Sorry. I just want to know how many it is. 1, 2, well, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. So, 17 is the max we can have. Okay, so, boom. Oh, no, that was one too many. What I meant to do was replace now. 46 million, worth every penny. Right, so that's that. Now, what I want to do is go to the other end and see. Uh, that's the fuel. This is what I want. Um, I want to make sure this one upgrades. So let's. Let's run it on two times speed. Come on, what are you going to do? Oh, no path. Ooh, okay. So something didn't work right. Uh, okay, let's get the track and the upgrade. So what didn't work? That's all okay. That all looks good. So, it's probably a little section somewhere that's, that didn't get upgraded. Um, no, that, that'll look, all looks okay. Okay, uh, I don't understand that. Do you understand that? I don't understand that. So, have a look at this. Are you saying... I unstop you. Waiting, that's waiting for a free path. So, so that's okay. So, what the hell's wrong with this one? Uh, where were we? Over here. What the hell is wrong with you? No path. But the, we've got the line showing. Okay, I'll tell you what. Let's flip you around. Oh, and now, suddenly, it's upgraded and it's fine. What the hell was all that about? Uh, you know what? Go back and load up properly. There we go. Because you, you could be carrying a lot more planks. No path electric. The hell? Uh, we've got catenaries. High speed. Okay, I think that's just a bit messed up. 
Let's flip you around again. So you're quite happy to run in that direction. So have a look at the track down here. It doesn't I mean it doesn't look like there's a problem down here, does it? Now this train's gonna come in, but obviously this isn't electric yet, so it wouldn't have that problem. So we'll see what happens when that upgrades. I think does that have a problem? Let's um, let's crank it up to full speed. So you pull in and you upgrade and you fill up and you go away. Okay, so there is no problem. So what the hell was wrong with the other one? It's a bit messed up, isn't it? Now, okay, pause. Now that we've done that, the next thing that we oops, the next thing we need to address is um, the oil because I noticed that over here we got a lot of oil building up. So. What do you think? Do we go the electric route? I think we probably kind of need to go the electric route. Again, I could double head the trains and stuff, but I think we just bite the bullet. Yeah, go on. Electric it is. Ele the age of electricity is here, I'm afraid. Um, but I am going to put the mallards in. So, so it's not com the age of steam is not completely dead yet. Oh, no. Right. Um, uh, before I do the tracks, upgrade the Blumen station, you bonehead. Right. So... We want high speed. We want containers. Yes. Boom. Bosh. And then, let's see. Tracks. Upgrade. Blah, blah, blah. Right. So, that bit. Boom. 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 Come on. Come on. Give it to me. You see, like, little tiny bits of track. It actually, like, makes them a little bit bigger than they actually are. So that you can see them a bit better. I gotta say, it's still a little bit fiddly sometimes. But, but it's, I gotta say, like as upgrading tracks go in games, this is this is not bad. It's pretty darn easy. Boom, boom. The only problem is it, it it does really kind of spoil the view when you're riding the trains and you've got like these like massive freaking catenaries everywhere. But, yeah, you know, there's nothing you can do about it, really. I don't know. Maybe we'll change when we get diesels or something. So, boom, 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 boom. I'm going to need to make that. Let's, let's just do the whole thing. Like, what the hell? Um, boom, boom, boom. And, come on. There, 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 there. Right, there we go. Now, this should already be, I think, both high speed and container. Yes, I thought it was. Because uh, it needs to be for shipping the stuff down there. All right. Having done that then, let's get these bumped up. So, we want Biggles Wade, crude and oil. We want to replace these trains. Uh, so, we were running 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. All right. Well, we're going to get rid of all of that nonsense. And we're going to have... I think we'll go with the 4 slash 7s again. Add and these one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten gives us a capacity of 150. Um, I'm gonna go one, two, three, four, five. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna ramp it up. Like what the hell? 20 million per vehicle. Wow, <laughs> stuff's getting expensive now. Replace 114 million. Holy crap! Yes, just do it. Go. So you're going to pull in, you're going to upgrade, probably will eventually, boom, oh, nice big shiny train. Starting to get some nice big trains now guys, I know that some of you guys like really like your big long trains, well we they're here, the big long trains are here. Now you know what, while I, while I think about it. What I should do is these trains. Now we don't necessarily. I mean, I'm mean, not worried about the locomotives, but um, these will run better if we put the newer trucks on. So that's what we're going to do because they're lighter. Uh, so what do we want? We want the line and replacement. So we were running. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. We were running ten. Let's get. Whoops. Let's just get rid of all of that. In fact, 
Uh, yeah. And then um, what do I want? What do I actually want? And do, 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 do. Uh, this is going to be... Yeah, it's going to be... I think it was a 4 slash 7 before. So 4 slash 7. What did I say? We had 10. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Let's say we're on like 8, eight of those. What the hell? Give us plenty of capacity. So, yeah, that's fine. Go away. Thank you. And replace now. Another 20 million. Boom. Off you go. Alrighty. Oh, look. Look, 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 look. We have got a lot of oil down here that needs to get shipped. 700 crude to get shipped. So, yeah. Bumping the, those trains. I think those trains need to get bumped up maybe even a bit more. Come on, trains, where are you? Okay, is something something wrong? What speed am I? Let's um let's speed her up. What the hell's going on? Whoops. Did you lag there? Oh, we've now got the no hab. Blooming marvelous, isn't it? I upgrade the freaking trains and then I get my first diesel. Oh, man. Oh, here it comes. Right, you. You are going to be expanded because we want to ship some of this oil. So what are we going to do? We're going to change this to... Uh, replacement. I'm, going to, I'm just going to bang a few more of these on, I think. So what do I want? I want these and one, two, three. Mm, let's stick another four on. Yeah. Replace now. Yes, please. Go. So, boom. What's your capacity now? 180. That's better. That'll start eating into that pretty quickly. That's good. All right. See, you can see just how many freaking problems there were around the place. Now, the next thing is um, we're going to increase the amount of crude that we're shipping up. We've already got, like... All this oil sitting here, so that means we're going to need even more. Now, what the hell's going on with this? Pause. What is going on with you? Now, hang on a second. Let's have a look at the lines. So, have we got the same issue? No path. Why? Let's, let's flip you around. Flip you around again. Okay, flip you around. I'll flip you around. No path. What is going on there? Okay, well, we're going to have to do that and let that one pull out. But that train didn't upgrade. Why? Why didn't that train upgrade? Um, they are scheduled for upgrade, aren't they? This is a Biggleswag crude nought. Oh, yeah, they were. Let's see if this one upgrades. Come on, upgrade your ass. Da, thank you. And see, now that one's working. Okay, this is a new problem. I've never seen this before. I wonder if this is something to do with the new patch. But a little bit weird, isn't it? A little bit weird. But we've now got, like, hugely increased capacity. So that's going to deal with that. We're going to be shipping more stuff in. So that means more oil means more plastic. So the oil gets shipped over to here. Right, that's going to mean we're going to have more plastic being created. So, let's see. Yeah, this is running full now. So, I think we're going to have to do something with this. Now, I could. I could do this with no habs. <laughs> or I could electrify it. And to be honest, like with th like this line, I, I wouldn't mind electrifying that line. Because it's... I mean, it's quite a nice line. It is quite, it is quite pretty around here, but... I don't know. Should we use some no-habs? Kind of tempted. Uh, ba -ba -ba let's see. Uh, you know, I'm going to leave that for a little bit. I want to go over and check on the old log situation. How are we doing over here? Are we moving these logs? What's production up to? Oh, here we go. Here we go. That's more freaking like it. So... Brings a load of, pla load of planks, picks up a load of logs, 234, sweet. Okay, so that's working nicely. Let's go over here where there's quite a lot of food. Okay, so what are you picking up? 
you're picking up 100. We've got over 200 sitting there. So, maybe, what do you think? Should we, should we bump these up to no habs? I think we should. Come on, let's do it. Let's do it. What the hell? Um, we'll, have these, we'll have the diesel trains running through, through the Chudley Valley. I think that'll be a bit nicer. So, what do I want? I want uh, these replacement. So, we were running with 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. We were running with 12 of those. Um, let's see. Let's see. Let's see what we can replace it with. So, where's our no habs? Now, let's have a look at the old no hab. So, this is 75 miles an hour, which is awesome. Um, Power is 2,000 horsepower and 2,000 horsepower. Now let's compare that with the A3-5. So it's, it's, it's getting on for twice as powerful. So yeah, I think this is going to be a good alternative. So let's go with the Nohab. And then we want the Mandwagon. So what did I say we had on there? 12. Uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. So that's running 20. I mean, it should handle that like pretty much no problem at all. All right, that'll do, I think. I think for now, replace. And it's another 35 million. Boom, go. Oh, and I, I've got to say, do like the no-haves. Uh, I think it's a really nice locomotive. Where are you? Are you down this end? Yeah, look at this. I, I love them in the, the bright red. Come here, you. I want to have a good old look at you. Actually, you know what I should do? Rather than following that one, what I should do is go down to the bottom and follow this one so that we can actually see what speed it gets to when it's going back up the hill. Oh, it, US food! Hooray! So, there we go. We've upgraded. Awesome horns on these. Good sound to it, isn't there? They are awesome, these things. I gotta say, I'm not a massive fan of like electric trains in general. I don't think they look as nice and they're not as interesting. I don't think they sound as good. And the thing is, they're not dirty and smoky and and that's what you want. You want steam and smoke and diesel fumes and that's what trains are all about. God, there's a lot of tunnels on this section, isn't there? Come on, come out the tunnel. Here we go. Um, so, like, what, what kind of speed are we? Yeah. I'm going to go back to the, like, the next one and just check the speed when it's coming to the hill because this has got a top speed of, what did I say, 75, I think? Yeah, 75. And I don't think we're getting... Where 48, 40, yeah. Yeah, we're not getting max speed out of it. Not with this track and whatever. Let's have a look at the... the is it the track that's holding us back or what? No, that's all 75. So, yeah, it's just pulling that weight up that hill. Oh, well. Uh, at least it's much better than it was, so. And now, we haven't got food backing up here. We haven't got food backing up here. Uh, what have we got there? 120. Yeah, it looks like we're staying on top of that. I, I think we could probably do with a few more trucks on there. Let's do that. Let's do that. Well, actually, yeah, let's just check. What's the production? Yeah, production's dropped off a little bit. Is it on the way back up? Let's have a look at the charts. Um, yeah, so we were up to around, like, probably, what, 1,300-ish? And then it dropped down, because something obviously got backed up. So, yeah, I am going to put some more trucks on there. Make sure that doesn't happen again. Uh, buy road vehicles, Opal Blitzes, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, that'll do, set line all, that's factory food, boom, go, right. That's, that's that dealt with. Okay, next, 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 next. Um, we still getting that down? No, I think that's getting, 
overwhelmed, you know. I think we need more trucks on here. I'm going to put more trucks on here. Buy road vehicles. Yeah, Opal Blitz. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So let's stick another 15 on there. Set line all. Chut the cow and grain. Boom, go. Yeah, we, de we definitely need those extra vehicles. Oh, here we go. Production's ramping up to max. It's on its way to 1600, I think. As long as we can... I think this was the holdup. So, with these extra trucks, if we could get on top of this, we might have uh, maxed out production. Wouldn't that be nice? Yeah, it's on the way all the way to 1600. But look at this. We're not keeping up. Oh. Oh, maybe we are. So wait, let's have a look at this. Ah, uh, no, production's dropping off. Oh man. Yeah, I might have to like double this lineup. Let's see. Now I've got these extra trucks, and we're getting on top of this. Let's let's let it recover and we'll see what happens um, how's the rest of it the rest of it's I think doing okay now yeah it seems to be all right moving on then moving on now how are we doing down here not there not Eastbourne uh, how are we doing down here so the oil we've got shipped but we're starting to see more goods now so these goods trains um, we're not shipping. We're not. They haven't got a whole lot of capacity. How much we got here? We got two hundred. Okay, let's do something about that then. Should we? What do you think? We should probably electrify these. Yeah. What the hell? Let's do it. So, uh, what do I want? Uh, pff, I have no idea. Um, get rid of that. So we're running five. So let's go for. Um, bum, 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 bum. We'll go. With, we'll stick with the same train so that we've got the same speed on both of them. And then I don't know. What do you think? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. So we've got about twenty wagons on there, which should be loads. Should be more than enough for this. Replace now. Uh, what? Okay. What's going on? Vehicles. Uh, yeah, we've got five vehicles to replace. Replace now. What? Okay, we got a little we got a little baguette, I think. What okay. <laughs> okay, that's just confused the hell out of me. What is going on with this? Replace. Replace now. No vehicles to replace. Yes there are. There are three. Um okay, let's I don't know, let's um, bum, 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 bum. um, let's upgrade this. Oh, is uh, this? I thought I'd upgraded these. No, I haven't. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, oh, well, okay. In that case, we'll use um, we'll use no habs. What the hell? Uh, bum, 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 what do I want? I want no habs. Should I electrify this? I'm going to use no habs for now. Just to make it quicker. Uh, you should be fine pulling that, I would think. So, so let's do, 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 do. Now, if I'm going to do that, then obviously I'm going to have to upgrade these to no habs as well. So, what do I want? We want vehicles. We're pulling 10, and that's 10 of the new ones. Oh, this is the one that I double-headed, isn't it? Yeah, okay. Well, now we can just sort that out, can't we? Yeah. So, let's get rid of those two. And uh, replace with a no hab. There you go. Boom. Replace now. Yes, please. Go. So. Come on, baby. Woohoo. We need a new class of a bandwagon. These wagon. Because these wagon cars don't really look right with a nice modern, modern ish no hab. It, that's a bit anachronistic. Cool. What did you pick up? 83. So what's your capacity? Uh, 120. 
We've got 120, well, now we've got 240 waiting, so that's kind of good. 150. And I could bump that up if we needed it, but it seems to be coping at the moment. So you get the hell out. Let's get the next oil train in. And here comes the next goods train. And he's going to pull straight into here. Yeah. Upgrade. Boom. Nice. Pick up your stuff. And off you go. Right. So, everything here looking good. Um, Planks is looking good. My God. Look at the freaking logs. Okay. Oh, okay. This like, yeah. It looks like we need to move a lot more logs. But, see, I'm thinking there's a problem. Yeah, there's a freaking problem down here again. Oh, man. What's the problem? Oh, that's the oil. Um, like, seriously, what? this is going to say no path. No path electric. Oh, man. I wonder, you know what, I'm just wondering if it's something to do with maybe because it's too long or something. Um, I'm going to cut this down by two. Yeah. yeah, I think I'm going to cut the size of that train down, but I don't know. I, I, like, because we're just going to keep getting the same problem. So replace, uh, let's take off one, two of those. To bring it down to less than the platform size. Replace. Yes. Okay. So now. Um, if I flip you around. Flip you around. What? Like what? Like what the hell is wrong with this? Yeah. I don't know. Catenary? No. Come on station. Yes. Boom. Oh, I just did second street connection. <laughs> Didn't want that. Catenary, yes. There we go. Boom. Why are you saying... Oh, now... Now it's okay. Hmm. Turn around so that you actually get a... See? No path electric again. Okay, there's, some, there's something seriously screwy going on with this. Okay, can, like, can you think what it is? Because I, I can't think what it is, and I, I can't think of a way to fix it. I mean, maybe reducing the length of the trains is, is a possible option. Okay, reducing the length of the trains does seem to have worked. I mean, they're all running now. Okay, well, that's... that. i got to say, that's kind of worrying, because stuff like that can really mess you up. All right. Um, ba -dum -bum -bum, so, so, let's ignore that. How are we doing with the oil situation? Um, that's fine. For those ships, like 200 oil is nothing. Ah, right. We've got... A fair amount of fuel building up over here. You know what? Let's have a quick look at the production numbers. So, oh, look at this. Both, well, this refinery is running at 1,600. The B refineries a little bit limited. Let's, uh, let's ch check the details. Um, so it's, it's just dipped off a little bit recently. Hmm. Maybe when we're getting maxed out demand, we're getting a bit backed up. Because that, that's like, that platform's pretty much almost full. It's not quite full, but it's almost full. So let's see. Sedberg and Tavistock. So. It looks like we want to increase our capacity a little bit. So where's the next train coming in? So you're, you've only got like five wagons. I think we need to upgrade these puppies. So, uh, replace. What are we going to replace these with? Uh, are we going to electrify? 
or are we going to go? We're just going to go diesel. I think you know what. Just just for now, I think I'm going to go diesel. I do, I, I do like my diesels, and it, I, I can do the upgrading of the tracks to electric like offline because it, it does get a bit boring just going around and doing that. So let's bang a let's bang one of those in, and we'll stick. Let's see. Yeah. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Replace now. Um, boom. Because there's only two trains on there. And then same with this one. This one's going to be... Oh, not the red arrow. We're going to look at the red arrow in a second. And tank wagon. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Uh, you know what? I don't think we need that much. Let's just one, two, three. Let's cut it down to like seven. Yeah. Yeah, that'll do. Replace now. Yeah, 60 million? Wow. Oh, because that's the Tabby Stop line. We've got more trains on there. Yeah. Yeah, yeah okay. Fine. In which case, I think I probably got that about right. Let's see. So what's going to be the capacity on these new trains? So we were carrying 45. We're now carrying over 100. So... Come on, Sedberg. There we go. That's better. And there's another Tavistock train coming down. i got to say, I am tempted to bang a few a few more cars on there. I think I'm going to. Yeah, I think I'm going to. Replace. And we'll just bang like three more on. One, two, three. Yeah. And replace now. Yes, please. Thanks very much. Bye. Cool. Let's get these well down. So what's the capacity now? About 150? Yeah, 150. Yeah, peachy. Alrighty, cool. So we're getting on top of that. Now that should enable the B refinery. I'm hoping to get maxed out. That's what I'm, that's what I'm trying for. So hopefully the B refinery will pick up and... I'd love to see them running like full on 1600. Uh, I was hoping to get the goods up a lot higher, but of course I messed up. Look at this. The Biggles Wade Oil Refinery is running at 1,600. Oh, my... Uh, no, sorry. Limit is, limit is 1,600. I thought that would run at 1,600 then. No. No. So it has been way up there, but it, it dropped off. Um, let's just go and check the route. Have you got any stuff, like, backing up? Production is still dropping off there. Well... Uh, Chudley Fuel Chudley Fuel could do with bumping up by the look of it that's a Chudley Goods train where's a Chudley Fuel train where the hell is a Chudley Fuel train that's a Chudley Fuel train I think we need a bit of an upgrade <laughs> Like, I think potentially we need quite a lot of an upgrade. Uh, what do I want? So what are we running now? Oh, we've got one vehicle with six trucks. Okay, let's switch you to a... Um, man, we're going to have to start doing some like, serious upgrading around here. Uh, I think I'm just going to bump up the number of trucks. I think I'm going to stick stick for now with an A3 until I figure out like exactly how I'm going to... Uh, no, I'm not. No, I'm not. I'm gonna go with it. I'm gonna go with the no hab. I'm gonna stick one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, like ten trucks on there. Uh, replace now. Yes. Right. So, where are you? Oh, Chudley Fuel. Uh, turn you around because we just missed the upgrade. So get yourself in there. That's it. Right. Yeah, but you didn't fill up, so I turn you around again. No path? What the hell? Turn you around. What? Why are you saying no path? Okay, whatever. Where have I flip you around now? Oh, there we go. There's something weird going on with the stations. The way the trains are behaving when, like, when they're in the stations with the pathing. I don't know what the hell's going wrong, but there's something going wrong. So now he'll pick up 150. Much better. 
Alrighty. But obviously, this thing can do like 75 miles an hour. Um, it's pulling a fair load though. But I'm thinking it's going to get stuck behind these. So I think we're going to have to upgrade these cuddly... Uh, cuddly. <laughs> cuddly good strides. No, chuddly. Chuddly good strides. So let's get that done. Let's get that done as well. So replace... Um, let's replace you with a no-hab. And I think we should probably maybe think about bumping up the... The forbearance range. One, two, three, four, five... Six, seven, eight. Yeah, that'll do. Right. Replace now. Yes. Boom. Go. Alrighty. Sir Wheat. And we're getting loads of food dumped down here. Look at this. We've got 246 food waiting to be shipped to Eastbourne. Wow. Okay. Well, Eastbourne goods needs to be um, ramped up. So let's do that. Um, let's see. What are you? I think we, I think, I mean, we could live with an A3 slash 5. That's fine. Um, and, but I think we need to bump it up to like, I don't know. What do you think? Like. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, maybe. What are we running now? Ah, uh, yeah, yeah, we're running with five. So we're doubling it up. Um, I'm, I'm wondering if even that's enough. I'm going to stick another two on. One, two. Let's do that. Replace now. And yes, please, go. Oh, okay. So now you're up to 12. Carrying 96. All right. Hopefully that'll stay on top of that. What else is getting backed up? Eastbourne fuel a little bit. Whoa, what is the one of the trains running on there? Oh, they're old as well. So, yeah. Uh, let's replace those. We'll stick with an A3 slash 5. And we'll just stick 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Replace now. Yes, please. Go. Oops. Okay, so that's going to improve that. Chudley fuel. Chudley fuel, I think, is okay. Yeah. What do we got? We've got... Go away. This is a no-hab, isn't it? I've already upgraded this, I think. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No-hab for 10 trucks. Cool. Alrighty. Whew, man. Okay, we've done, we've done like, quite a lot. Um, the, I want to do one more thing before the end of the episode. My God, it's been a busy old episode, hasn't it? Uh, I wanted to go to the Red Arrow. Now, I'm actually going to rename this in the next episode because um, I got a really nice email from somebody telling me about, um, or reminding me, because I knew about it, of a um, uh, a crash that occurred in Bournemouth, or just outside Bournemouth, which involved the Red Arrows display team. But you know what? I'm I'll do that at the beginning of the next episode, and um, we'll re rename the line. Um, so what do I want to do? I want this line. We are going to replace these threes with just ones. So I just want one. So replace now. Yes. Go. Uh, and then what we're going to do is bang more on. So, buy trains. Do, do, do. That's a no-how. Red arrow. Buy. And we want... Pff, how many? One, two, three, four, five. Six. Set line all. This is the red arrow. Boom. Go. So, we're going to have very high frequency. Oh, and we're actually getting passengers. Look at that. But now we're going to have, like, very high frequency, but small trains. So, they're... It's kind of like a rail bus. That is the plan. So, you're going to whiz on out. Next one comes along... How many passengers are you going to get? No, no passengers. But we've got, we, we, we are getting people using this line. And now I've increased the frequency. What's the frequency up to? So look, where are we? The red arrow. Frequency every 40 seconds. That might be a bit much, actually. I, I might need to, <laughs> might need to trim that back a little bit, but we'll see. We've now got the class 5 100. Yeah. No, we 
might be alright. We might be alright, spacing-wise. We'll see. Uh, no. Nah, there's one, one coming back already. So, yeah, I might need to get rid of... I don't know. Well, I don't know. Let's see. Let's see. I don't see another one coming down yet. So you're going to change into one. And get the hell out. And you're going to come down. You're going to change into a single. And get the hell out. We're getting increased passenger numbers? I don't know. It's hard to tell. Uh, you've got four people on board. You're delivering 14. How many are you going to pick up? Yeah. Only one. And we've got the next train there. So you're going to come in. Where's the next one? Well, I think I saw it coming round there. Yep. There's the next one coming around. Looks like the spacing I got about right. And that was like total guesswork. I hadn't planned that out. Trust me. What are you going to end up? Oh, you got six passengers. Oh, look at this. Maybe increasing the frequency has done the job. Now, what I was thinking was, guys, um, and this will be for the next episode. So my question for you at the end of this episode should, is, should I extend this? Like, I don't know, maybe put in an underground station in the center of, um, where the hell is this? Oh, Tavistock. Maybe put an underground station in Tavistock and then just hook it up to, to this station so that people have got a, like a faster route to get to the airport. Might give us more passengers. Um, I'm going to get rid of a freaking plane as well. You, go to the depot be sold. There we go. Um, the, the, planes, the planes aren't waiting, are they? For, for No, they're not waiting for a full load or anything. Pretty sure. No, and no. So, I'm not sure what else I can do to kind of clear this backlogging thing. I could get rid of a, like one more. I don't really want to, though. So look, how we do passenger-wise? That's uh, not what I wanted. That's what I wanted. No, that's what I wanted. Lines. Um, see, this one's running close to capacity. That's doing well. It's this one that's not doing. It's the Biggleswade Ashton line. But it, I don't know. Maybe it's picking up a little bit. Maybe we should. Maybe we should just wait for the next episode and see what happens. So, um, but that's. That's this. That's not even this one. That's the, the problem line is this one. So I don't know. Maybe maybe we don't need to extend this. But do you think we should anyway? I mean, we've already got the tram link coming out here, which is kind of not too bad. But I think putting the putting the red arrow, putting an extension into the centre of town, I think that's got to be a good idea, hasn't it? All right. Well, let me know what you think, guys. Let's have a bit of a zoom out. Um. Things are looking pretty good over here. Ooh, look at all the oil. And um, we've got oil. Where the hell is that oil? Come, where has that oil come from? The refined oil. That's kind of weird. No idea. Um, we've got rid of all the backlog down here. We, how are we doing up here? Uh, not looking too bad might want to check out that put some more vehicles on this let's just do that quickly by ride vehicles opal blitz one two three four five and put you on what line is this oh it's chudley fuel and goods boom there you go get that down all right guys so the question red arrow do we extend it and if you've got any tips for all the other stuff let me know i will catch you for the next one i hope you enjoyed this one peace out